All right, some latest news coming in in a showcase of India's role in global space innovation and collaboration. ISRO's commercial space seven, mission is launching six, the European Space Agency five, Proba 3. Four, three, two, one, zero. Majestically flow for the ESLV C59 Proba 3 mission from the Satish Dhawan Space Center. यहाँ TSLV C59 प्रमोशन यान का सफलतापूर्ण उत्थापन रेंज ऑपरेशन डायरेक्टर ने भी इसकी पुष्टि कर दी है यह पूरी तरह सामान्य उत्थापन है और Now those are the live shots coming in from Sri Harikota as ISRO began a revised countdown on Thursday for the launch of the European Space Agency's Proba 3 mission. Remember, this comes following a delay caused by an quote-unquote anomaly detected in the satellite propulsion system. Now the Bengaluru-based space agency rescheduled the launch of the European Space Agency's ESA Proba 3 mission to today and the liftoff took place at about 4 or 4 a.m. A PM, pardon me on that, after a request from ESA, it was initially scheduled for a Wednesday at 4, 8 p.m. from their spaceport. But as we told you, there was an anomaly detected at the, in the satellite propulsion system after which it was delayed. Now, as we get you the live visuals from Sri Harikota, now this is ISRO's fourth launch mission of this year and this is being closely tracked by the scientists sitting in Sri Harikota to see how it pans out and if the plan goes according to what has been defined. Now these spacecraft are designed to operate in precise formation, maintaining accuracy to a millimeter to examine the corona, the sun's outer atmosphere. According to uh, ESA, the sun's corona is much more hotter than its surface and it serves as the origin of space weather, making it a subject of substantial scientific and practical interest. Now, the primary goal is to showcase precise formation flying capabilities with both spacecraft units being deployed simultaneously in a stacked arrangement once they reach the intended orbital position. It's also important to note that the PSLV C-59 rocket, standing 44.5 meters tall, marks its 61st flight and the 26th mission utilizing the PSLV XL variant designed for deploying heavier satellites. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.